Haiwatha. Haiwatha is basically a poem. This poem is about a little boy, a very little young Indian, young red Indian boy. Young red Indians are a tribe basically. So he was belonging to a tribe. He has been living with his grandmother all the time. So his grandmother has been telling him all the good stories of all the natural things that exist. That is about the stars, about the trees, the insects, the birds and animals. And so these were the beautiful wonders that are available all around us. So he has been growing up with all these beautiful stories around. So he could actually manage to talk to the birds and to even he could talk to the animals and he could make them obey him. Then the little Havatha learnt of every bird its language, learned their names and all their secrets, how they built their nests in summer, where they hid themselves in winter, talked with them whenever he met them, called them Hiawatha's chickens. So you know here that little boy Hiawatha had learned every bird's language. So he could manage to talk to every kind of a bird on his own. He had named their names. He now knew about all the birds' secrets, how they used to build their nets during summers, how they are managing themselves in winters because in winters birds are hiding themselves some or the other place. So he was coming slowly and slowly he had become friends with these birds and he managed to gather all the secrets about the birds personal lives. Talked with them whenever he possibly he would meet them and he used to call them Haiwatha's chickens. Of all the beasts he learned the language from learned their names and all their secrets. Now the beast, rest of the remaining were the beast. So he had been learning the languages of them. How the beavers built their lodges, where the squirrels hid their acorns. Now other than these birds, there were the other animals. He has addressed them as the beast and he talked that he has learned even their language and he could manage to know that how the beavers are managing their lodges and how the squirrels are hiding their acorns. Acorns are the food that the squirrels eat. So the squirrels have the habit of hiding their food for the later on purposes. So how they manage to hide them. How the reindeers are managing to run so swiftly. So that these were all the secrets that were being known, that were being inquired by little Hiawatha. Why the rabbit was so timid? Means the rabbit is so fast all the time talked with them whenever he managed to find them and call them Hiawatha's brothers and rest of them he addressed as his own brothers. So this was a little boy who was a red Indian who belonged to a red Indian tribe. He has been growing up with all the beautiful wonderful stories that his grandmother used to tell him and because of which he had developed a very beautiful connection with these natural animals and these natural birds and because of which he has managed to understand their lives, their secrets, their way of living.